what are the signs? What are some things that maybe individuals who don't know much about this can look for within their friends, within their parents, maybe within themselves? I know that if I had heard about abuse before, I never, it never even connected for me until it did, right? Years and years later. What are some signs that people maybe that are off to the sidelines can kind of just be aware of in their life so that they can start being a lifeline maybe for somebody that they wouldn't, you know, like what you said, who maybe have a stereotype of it only happens within certain sex and then recognizing that you're their neighbor. Right. And it's happening to you. Yeah. So some of the signs, they're so subtle. I mean, mm-hmm. if it's not a black eye or a broken arm or marks on the arm or, you know, it's so subtle, especially the emotional abuse and spiritual abuse and financial abuse. But a huge sign is the person uh, has to answer a phone call frantically. Let's say you're out having coffee with a oh. girlfriend and she's like, oh my gosh, I got to get this. Just can't, just one second. Okay. I get, cause he's going to be really mad. Yeah. Wow. That's a huge sign. Or if she does this while you're at coffee, always checking your phone yeah. because if you don't answer, if she doesn't answer, yeah. then she's going to get the shit beat out of her at home. Right. Yeah. In whatever way it might not be physical. Um, if the person that she's dating, married to whatever shows up at your lunch date, just to make sure she's there. Yeah. Especially if she didn't say, Oh, by the way, I invited so-and-so or I let him know that I'm going to be here. Um, he might stop by. There's a difference between that. And yeah, well, I had to tell Bob that we were coming here. Um, just cause he likes to know where I am. It's a problem. You know, there's, again, it's that listening to yourself. Are you telling this person because you love them and you want to share life? Like hubby and I, of course I tell him, I'm going to go have lunch with so-and-so and we're going to be here as opposed to the abuser. Uh, so I'm going to go have lunch uh, with my friend and we're going to be here. Yeah. You know, it's, it's listening to yourself and it's like the energy with which you share the information. It's, it's either this, that somebody sharing the information or they're like, oh, this is what's going on. And this person's going to know about it. And it's so exciting. So listen to those and watch for those subtle, subtle cues for sure. And if yeah. she's not allowed to go anywhere without him, oh, it's a problem. It's a big problem. Yeah. Yes. To all of that. And all of that was, was seen in my relationship. Same sister. Same. So much. Yeah. Yeah. Very, very good. 